Yes, folks. Uh, yes, the sun rays are starting to get pretty powerful. <laughs> uh, we'll be heading soon. Feels like it, anyways. We'll soon be heading to the camp, and uh, uh, when I think of that, uh, we we'll have some work to do uh, this year. Uh, one of the jobs is uh, I have a winch on my tractor, and uh, I got some uh, heavy-duty pulling to do. And uh, hang on, uh, me to few diagrams <laughs> I'm gonna show you uh, I'm gonna show you the what I bought <laughs> it's not an unboxing I'm not sponsored by no one it's uh, it's just your normal uh, hang on hang on I don't want to show you <laughs> You've seen it before, eh? See this, folks? See this? This is what... Mm -hmm. Hang on. See, this is what they call... See that? And you put your pull... Ooh, look at that. Ooh, ooh. Ha, ha, ha. Ooh, ooh. Ha. You don't put your hands there because it may get sticky. But that's uh, it's made by a ranger. Maximum load 16,000. No, 16 ton. 32. Hang on. <laughs> right here. 36,000 pounds. Ah, that should be good, I think, <laughs> for what I want to do. I have a, a heavy-duty pull, let's say, to do, and uh, I won't divulge, <laughs> I won't divulge what it's going to be all about. You're going to see the setup once, uh, well, I'll be making a video of this on, at the camp, but uh, hang on. Shouldn't have closed it so fast. See, uh, a pulley like that, I made notes here. See, a pulley like that will get the uh, mechanical advantage and it'll, it'll change direction. Me, what I'm working on is a mechanical advantage. I'm not too good at drawing. Let's see, here's my tractor. And uh, this is what I... This is the load, and this is a anchor point. See, if I just put one, I'll just be pulling like that, and this will give me an advantage of two to one. But me, I already have. See, they call these. Hang on. I'll sit myself down. They call these. <coughs> They call these snatch blocks, eh? That's to give mechanical advantage. My winch, it's a hydraulic winch. I don't know how much it pulls. It pulls. Uh, I use it to draw the, uh, the, the, the dock out of the water, eh? And uh, I don't know how much it pulls, but the pull I have to do will necessitate a uh, good <laughs> hardy pull. So here we go. This is the way I'm going to be set up. Hang on. This will be the tractor. I'm going to go to the load point. Go in the chain. Put a pulley. Come back to the... To, well, this will be an anchor point, which will be a tree or something. I'm going to go back to the whatever I want to pull, go to another pulley, and then finish off at the finish off at the anchor point, which is the tree. So I have 
one pulley there and two pulleys here. This is a tractor winch. A tractor winch, two pulleys there and one pulley here plus a dead uh, dead anchor here. And that'll give me that'll give me four to one four to one pull. So I am gonna pull four times uh, stronger than what the winch on the tractor is. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna tie that tractor off. <laughs> uh, I don't want to split the ta tractor. Like uh, I know the bell housing right in the center. Hang on, we'll put this now that you know the, the whole story. Uh, I'm gonna put you back here. Uh, I don't want to. Uh, split the tractor in two because I know the bell housing on the tractor about midpoint is made out of uh, magnesium. Ah, uh, that's right, I bought a reinforcing under uh, carriage for the tractor which is uh, oh almost half inch steel so I don't think I'll rip it apart but ah, I don't care to damage a tractor, so I'll probably what I'll probably do is like put the the box blade, uh, sit it on something, and then I'll spool off some cable and we'll set up the pulleys. And uh, that's as strong as the all the system is. Eh? <laughs> and uh, I don't know. I, I think it's gonna work. Now's the time. Okay. Come uh, next spring, summer, it's not time to start shopping for all you're going to buy and all you're going to fix up. The, uh, some of these things are hard to get uh, come time. So uh, it's good to think ahead. First of all, think ahead of what you're going to be doing this year. And then uh, it's not only fun and games. There's some projects that have to... <laughs> To be done, eh? And this, this one here, I won't divulge a project yet, but uh, it has to be done. And uh, I am pretty sure with a four to one advantage on the winch, I'm pretty sure I got uh, successes at hand. <laughs> We're in the April April now, so uh, I don't see why. <laughs> Why we can't soon go to the camp? The only thing holding me back is there's probably two, two and a half feet of snow in the road, and it's all packed and iced up. Eh? And uh, but uh, it at this time of the year, the sun is beating down on it real good, and uh, with a few rains there, uh, it'll be gone in no time, and uh, we'll be heading up there. And this year we're going to have some invites up there and uh, we're going to put in some fishing time and uh, maybe uh, <laughs> have ourselves a shore lunch and, <laughs> and God knows what else. <laughs> so yeah, stick in there friends and uh, make sure you're there at the next <laughs> adventure of this storytelling time. <laughs> For gators, uh, shore lunch and fishing stories. <laughs> okay, folks, that's it. I come as a welcome. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs>